Ladies and gentlemen, the first sergeant of Company H, First Sergeant Adams. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise, remove all hats for the presentation of the colors, and remain standing for our national anthem. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time we will introduce the drill instructors of Company H. We ask that you please hold your applause until all the drill instructors have been introduced. The senior drill instructor of Platoon 2016 is Staff Sergeant Moda from San Diego, California. He is assisted by drill instructors Staff Sergeant Andino from Carolina, Puerto Rico. Sergeant Portel from Miami, Florida, and Sergeant Gonzalez from Edinburgh, Texas. The Senior Drill Instructor of Platoon 2017 is Staff Sergeant Woods from Chicago, Illinois. He is assisted by Drill Instructors Staff Sergeant Sanders from Hartwell, Georgia, Staff Sergeant Parks from San Diego, California, and Sergeant Goldwire from Springfield, Georgia. The Senior Drill Instructor of Platoon 2018 is Staff Sergeant Kenyon from Oxford, New York. He is assisted by Drill Instructors Sergeant Borchard from Elkhart, Illinois, Sergeant Hill from Trinity, North Carolina, Sergeant Miller from Memphis, Tennessee, and Sergeant Selden from Dayton, Ohio. The Senior Drill Instructor of Platoon 2020 is Sergeant Martinez from Miami, Florida. He is assisted by drill instructors Sergeant Wolin from Green Bay, Wisconsin, Sergeant McCann from Tulsa, Oklahoma, and Sergeant Stone from Dallas, Texas. The senior drill instructor of Platoon 2021 is Staff Sergeant Cook from Hendersonville, North Carolina. He is assisted by Drill Instructors, Staff Sergeant Perry from Homer, Oklahoma, and Sergeant Polk from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The Senior Drill Instructor of Platoon 2022 is Staff Sergeant Sullivan from Riva, Maryland. He is assisted by Drill Instructors, Staff Sergeant Seifel from Winston-Salem, North Carolina, and Sergeant Van Beacom from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Ladies and gentlemen, the drum instructors of Company H.
launching onto the parade ground in company age. They began their training on the 10th of December 2011, and today's graduation marks the end of a demanding and difficult 12 weeks of training for them. These young men you see marching before you have met and mastered the challenge of recruit training. They have qualified for the service rifle and received basic warrior training. They have completed over 200 hours of academic instruction and participated in a rigorous physical training program that has developed their strength and stamina for the challenges ahead. Core values have been instilled in each of them, the meaning of honor, courage, and commitment. Marching before you this morning are 404 success stories, each of them a testament to the physical courage, dogged determination, and a unique commitment to excellence that defines the title, Marine. This is what they have striven and persevered for, the right to walk across this parade deck as Marine. They have earned this title to demonstrate courage and achievement, and now join the proud ranks of over one million Marines who have graduated from Paris Island. From this day on, they will carry on the proud legacy and history of the United States Marine Corps. Ladies and gentlemen, the Marines of Company H. are being aligned from left to right in order to get them into their exact position for the ceremony.
I'd like to thank you and also thank you on behalf of Brinkle Brinkle. Please give yourself a round of applause. These Marines were all seen by their recruiters. These hardworking Marines spent countless hours in hometown just like yours, searching for the best qualified applicants to come to recruit training. It was the recruiters who first saw the potential in these Marines and offered them the challenge of a recruit training. Please join me in a round of applause for your Marine recruiters. I'd like to recognize the drill instructors and their family, and these highly professional Marines dedicating themselves to transforming the recruits in the United States Marine. They do that by setting the example of what it is to be a Marine and instilling our core values. They are directly responsible for what you see here today. Without them, none of this would be possible. Please join me in a hearty, well deserved round of applause for our young
The Cooper Reef is here in the Pacific Island and has selected as the honorary of the Federal Chief. They will now retire their guidance.
Now, the senior graduates are here to land the sense of the communities. When it's in the science, they have all their own to welcome over the new work in their team. But the senior graduates are here.